Yikes. Okay, I'm feeling very uninspired lately and I'm really tired this morning. Mm. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna do the most random vlog. That's what we're gonna do today, okay? Okay, first, my hair looks like a frizz ball. I'm gonna order some Starbucks because our fridge stopped working, so therefore all of the milk is hot and all of the creamer's hot. We love that. That's okay. I kinda want a Starbucks anyways. You're the one I trust. It's just so good. Mm. Good morning, y'all. Um, welcome back to my channel. I don't even know why I say that. I feel like that's such like a tip. Like, welcome back to my channel. So like and subscribe. You know what? Whatever. I'm gonna start saying my own things. I'm gonna start saying, "Welcome to Big Mama's house." Do we like that? No. <laughs> I kind of like it actually. Okay, maybe today I didn't really have anything planned and if we're being completely honest do you ever get those times when you feel like just like overwhelmed by like everything in your life because that's kind of like where i am right now and i just feel very like uninspired i guess i love making vlogs it's my favorite thing to do i love editing that's probably my favorite part of doing youtube but i just feel like i want to give you guys more substance I don't even really know if you guys know what I'm talking about, but yeah, I don't know. I'm just feeling a little bit down. So today what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and I'm going to do everything that makes me happy. Okay. That's what I'm going to do. I don't know. Morale is kind of like me. So first off, I got the world's best coffee, pumpkin cream cold brew. If you haven't had it, you need to have it. I'm not gonna sit here and tell you it's the healthiest thing in the world. It's not. But it's delicious and it's healthy for your soul, okay? First stop, I'm going to White Rock Lake, which is one of my favorite places in Dallas. I think it's just so beautiful. I'm gonna stretch and I'm gonna get out my notebook and I'm gonna journal a little bit and I'm gonna brainstorm for video ideas, project ideas, and write down some goals I wanna do. I feel like this vlog is really important because like it's okay to feel sad and it's okay to feel down and like not have great days. I think a lot of you guys think that I don't have days like that and I definitely do. I never want it to seem like I like only show the good parts of my life because that's just not how life works. Not every day is gonna be the greatest day of your life and today's kind of one of those days like I just kind of woke up feeling very mediocre like kind of down about myself and kind of like confused about my purpose and what i'm supposed to be doing and just kind of uninspired about like everything you know one of the things that i like to do is first off you should always like pray about it and pray to god and just like ask him for guidance and i always feel like when i pray i kind of like get sidetracked so a little tip is i like to write letters to god so like actually physically writing out my prayer kind of and also it's like kind of a way of like getting out my emotions and like journaling and it's cool to look back on but it also just kind of helps me keep like structure to my prayer if you guys don't know how to pray or you're kind of like scared to start this is an awesome way i feel just a little bit lost right now and um yeah i mean i don't even know why i'm like saying all this to be quite honest with you but yeah i don't know it's kind of weird it's a weird place i'm in you know but it's really peaceful out here and 
I love coming out here just to like sit and think and like be by the water. Okay, on a very unrelated note, um, I just drank this whole coffee and uh, there's no bathrooms out here. If you're picking up what I'm putting down, we're in trouble. Honestly, I already feel a little bit better. Just kind of like a clear head. Sometimes I just like to be alone and just think about things. But next, we're gonna go to my favorite place of all time, which is Trader Joe's. And then I'm probably gonna go to Joanne's Fabric. I wanna do something creative and I ordered this sweatshirt on Amazon a while back and I wanna try and make it into like a tie-dye, ripped, cool looking thing, kind of just to get my creative juices flowing. Because doing crafts and stuff like that makes me really happy. So, you know what? I'm gonna do all the things that make me happy today. That's what this vlog is about. So, I do want to talk about something though. I think it's very odd that I think that there's like a strong correlation between people's anxiety and depression and like mental health and social media. I feel like there's this stigma about people on social media and that everything on social media has to be like so positive and happy and I mean I agree like I like watching people who are happy I agree with that but that's not life and it's not realistic so that's why I decided to vlog today. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't even know why I'm crying. I was just, <laughs> I was reading some of your DMs because I posted on my story just like kind of how I'm feeling and a little Bible verse that like comforts me and it's really overwhelming and like I don't know, it just it just makes me sad how many of you like are feeling the same way that I'm feeling. It's comforting in a way, but it's also just like makes me a little bit sad because I feel like this day and age that we're in, like people put so much pressure on themselves, me included, to like do better and, and always be like one-upping yourselves and like, I don't even know if that makes sense, but I don't know. Sometimes you just need a good cry, you know? Like I could just sit here and like, cry <laughs> if this video can just comfort even one of you out there then it's like worth it for me to make it um i just wanted to say that i love you guys and you're always so supportive of me and everything that i do and i'm like i truly am like so grateful for you but yeah that's it That is always my go-to song to make me feel better and it works every single time. Mariah just kills it. Love that girl. Okay, so I went to Target. I found something that made my whole day better. Okay, so I just have to show you. These were on the $5 aisle. You know I love to shop there. They're two little coffee canisters so I can put my cold brew in it. That is just the cutest thing ever. These just made my day just a little bit brighter. It's the little things, you know? So now I'm gonna go inside and tie-dye that sweatshirt. Hopefully it turns out good. We all know how my tie-dyeing skills turned out last time. Not great. And I have to tell you guys a very, very embarrassing, funny story. <sighs> just, just, just wait. Okay, let's do this thing. This is giving me flashbacks to when I tried to do tie-dyeing last time. Didn't, didn't, didn't go very well. But you know what? I'm determined to make this one better. This is also bleached, so I feel like I can't mess it up as much. We're just gonna do random little places. Also, I told you guys that I was going to tell you a funny story that happened to me. If you follow me on Instagram, you will know that I am now working with Fabletics, which I am so excited about because they have like the best athletic wear ever. Anyways, this video is not sponsored. I'm just letting you guys know. So when I was like sending in my videos, <laughs> I'm so dumb. I'm literally just like thinking about it. It's so funny. So when I was sending in my videos to like get approved for Instagram, 
I was wearing these blue leggings, which are so cute. And like, you know how leggings, the style of leggings nowadays is popular to have like the lace up in the middle. You know what I'm talking about. I'll post a picture right here. Well, they have a style like that. It's very cute. I've seen them where the lace up is in the front and the back. Like I've seen both ways. So I don't know why, but I assumed <laughs> that the lace up was supposed to be in the, in the front. Okay, well, they responded to me and they were like, Um, she's actually wearing them backwards. <laughs> I was like, oh, <laughs> that's so embarrassing. <laughs> it was just so embarrassing, just so bad. It was literally like the most embarrassed I've ever been in my entire life. Yeah, but that's just a little funny story. I'll post, um, I ended up not posting that video. They were like, yeah, you could just scrap the whole thing. No, they were nice about it, but I just died because it was so funny. I don't know how it's gonna turn out. Why am I sitting like this? <laughs> final product not too shabby it kind of came out more bleachy than I was hoping for but um I don't know I think it's kind of cool I kind of want to like rip it up also and put like some rips holes in it but now I think we're gonna go blade a little bit and just get some time outside because it is a beautiful day today so let's go we head for the sky it's all right our wings wouldn't fly it's all right if we are crashing down again Pieces of love, it's all right Scattered in mud, it's all right You're giving me a lie again And tell me what you want This time I won't take it to the heart Cause I know we won't make it out I've heard it all before Wanna say something free? Ew! Nobody wants that. Oh, that's going, that's going viral. Bound to go Why is he like Dwight Schrute? He is literally Dwight Schrute. It's Woo! Right. Oh, the slippery slot. I think I'm gonna end off this vlog here. My day did not start off ideally, and I feel like I've been kind of in just like a very uninspired, like kind of bleh mood for like the past probably like few weeks. Yeah, I just think it's really important to like make a vlog like this to kind of show you guys that like not everything you see on the internet is like has to be perfect and not everybody's life on the internet is perfect at all. We all have down days sometimes, but I hope this video was entertaining for you in some way, but also kind of give you an insight that don't judge somebody just by their social media account or like what you see online because 100% of the time, it's not their entire life. Like, it's just what they want you to see. So, yeah, I love you guys, and I hope you're all staying safe. Uh, see you guys next time.